So you want to know how much money you can save with the EG4 two-ton or 24K solar mini split? Hey, my name is Rodney, and if you're into DIY solar and self-reliance, hey, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. So we're going to go ahead and pull up some screenshots on my phone, and I'll go ahead and put those up here for you. But bottom line is, it's pretty unbelievable how much money my buddy's saving. Bottom line is, he's running the EG4 solar mini split, running his whole house. And these are really meant for one big room, but he's running multiple bedrooms, his living room, his dining room, kitchen. He's got a smaller house. The only room it's not getting is his bedroom all the way in the back of the house. And we went on ahead and put a unit back there just for the bedroom. But we're, right now we're just talking about the EG4 and how much money this one's saving. So we're gonna go ahead and show you a screenshot of his electric bill basically. And basically, let's say July the 5th, you know, he used 84 kilowatts, you know, next day, 70, 81, 78, 69, 68. And a lot of the time, the days before these were in the 90s, 90 kilowatt hours a day. So let's, we're going to go ahead and say an average of 80 kilowatts is what he was using before he put the mini split in. So running on his old, basically 20 year old central heat and air HVAC system, you know, using about 90, 80 kilowatt hours on average. So let's go ahead and see what he's using now. So now we can go to about July the, the 26th. I think it, on the 25th is when we installed the grid. So it's running daytime on solar and at night it's running on the grid. But the mini split is a lot more efficient than his old unit. So we're going to show you what he's pulling from the electric company. So basically on the 25th, he pulled 44 kilowatts. I mean, the 25th we installed it. So half that day was running on his old unit. So the 26th, we did 39 kilowatts. On the 27th, 40. On the 28th, 36. On the 29th, 35. On the 30th, we did about 30. On the 31st, he did 23. I mean, that is pretty unbelievable. And we'll go ahead and show you his uh, usage right here for the last couple of weeks. So right here, as you can just see the numbers a little easier, the 29th to the 1st, you know, anywhere from 35 to 23 kilowatt hours in a day. So basically he's saving anywhere from 50 to 60 kilowatt hours a day in power usage by using this mini split instead of using his central heat and air unit that's about 20 years old. That shows you how inefficient that thing is. I mean, it's pretty unbelievable. He will have his unit paid off in no time because he's gonna be saving way, way over $100 a month in his electric bill. We'll go ahead and show you what it's gonna look like. We'll go ahead and run the numbers. Let's just say he's saving at a minimum on average 50 kilowatt hours a day. And let's say your electric is a, a nine cent. You know, that's what our rate is here. You know, your rate's gonna be different. So if your rate's a lot higher, you're gonna pay for your unit a lot faster. So that is four and a half dollars a day. Let's just say there's 30 days in a month. That's $135 times 12. So in a year, that's $1,620. So in a few years, he's gonna have this unit paid for and be good to go. And if you're wondering, you know, what the total cost of this unit is, I got a video, so you can go check that out above that I already put out. It gives you the total cost breakdown on what we spent on putting his unit in. So, I mean, that's pretty unbelievable. I wanna know what you guys think about that cost savings. And the only thing we changed was not using his central heat and air old HVAC system, like a three ton or whatever, that's probably like 20 years old. And we're just using the mini split for something that it's not even really made for. We got it in one small room and it's going into a couple of uh, bedrooms, his living room, his kitchen, and it's cooling all those. I mean, it's unbelievable. Of course, this house is smaller, but still, this these mini splits are really made for one room. Either it's a big room, a small room, depending on the size of the unit, but it just shows you what these things can do and it's pretty unbelievable. If you have one of these installed, hey, let me know what size room you got this in or if you got, got it going in multiple rooms and how much money you're saving. Hey, remember, if you like this kind of video, hey, go ahead and hit that subscribe button, hit the like button, and thanks for watching.